I'm Ilya Marchenko. I'm Janis Kuda. I'm Jesper de Jong. I'm Henry Laksan. Oh. I'm Sanseko Segundolo. And you're listening to the Game to Love podcast. Hello, everyone. My name is Megan. I'm sure you're probably expecting David, but I am back after Wimbledon. And we are here for the Bastard semifinals. We've got Francisco Serundolo and Pablo Carreño Busta just getting in the way. Serundolo is serving to begin this first and opening set. You have a second serve here for Serundolo. Back and return from Carreño Busta. Now with the cross court. Down the line. Oh, just lands on the baseline from Serundolo. He now goes cross court on the back and back and cross court from Carreño Busta. Serundolo with the backhand as well. Oh, a slice there from Carreño Busta. We're slicing now. Carreño goes to the inside out forehand. This is a good rally here to open up this uh, opening set. Serundolo back cross court. PCB with a cross court. Oh, and finally produces the error from Serundolo as he goes wide. It's 15 all. So thanks everybody for joining me again. Uh, I, yeah, I am back. Hopefully, I'll be covering a couple of the final, well, one of, or two of the finals tomorrow as well. I will be covering Bastard today, so I'm doing this one, and then you'll have David doing Baez versus Rublev later. Hi, JC, and yeah, everybody, listen to JC. Please hit the like button and subscribe as well. Really appreciate it. It really does help, honestly. Oh yeah, and a prediction here as well. Serundolo in three sets. This should be a good one, this. Serundolo, I think, is a very exciting young player to watch. And, of course, PCB has been doing very well this week. He got that really good win over Diego Schwartzman uh, the other day. I think it was 11-1. So he's he's on a bit of a roll, as Carreño Busta. But Serundolo, again. Serundolo, I think, looking for a second ATP Tour title. No, he actually hasn't won. I, th I thought he'd won a, a title earlier this year, but maybe that was his brother. I'm sure he'd he'd done pretty well anyway. I think he got to a final, but uh, no, he is looking for a maiden uh, ATP Tour title. Karina Busta, of course, is uh, no stranger to the ATP Tour. He's already won six titles, looking for a seventh, but they have to reach the final first. Should be a good semi-final matchup, though. Serundolo here, a 30-15 with a second serve. Back and cross court to Carreño. Oh, it's long there from Serundolo. 30 all. Hope you are all having a wonderful weekend wherever you are in the world. Don't forget to hit the like button if you haven't already. I would very much appreciate it. But uh, such a busy couple of weeks with Wimbledon. It always seems like a bit of a come down now with these. Uh, and it's always strange with these tournaments on clay as well, straight after the grass. And then obviously we're going into the hards for the US Open. So it seems a bit, I don't know, it's a bit of a confusing point in the tennis calendar, I think, these tournaments. But this would be a good chance here for Sarundalo to try and get maybe a first ATP title. And he has got 40-30 here, a point to get a game on the board. Hello, MQR. Hope you're doing well today. Salundolo here at 40-30. It's a good first serve. Backhand return from Carreño Busta. Cross court from Serundolo. Oh, and the backhand is long from Carreño Busta. So Serundolo does get the game. It is one game to love for Francisco Serundolo. Francisco. Crashing from MQR. So uh, it won't be me streaming it. It'll be David, but we will be bringing you the Baez Rublev match here as well. But David is doing that one for you. So we have Carreño Busta here serving his first service game of the match. Semi final match, the first of the day. Carreño Busta with the first serve. Back and return from Serundolo. Carreño Busta runs around it for the forehand. Now the cross court back and from Serundolo. Big forehand cross court from Carreño Busta. It's into the net from Serundolo. 15 love. Hi, Lexi. Good to see you again as well. Yeah, it's nice to be back. It's been a bit of a busy week. I'm in a mad scramble to get my uh, my thesis finished in time, but uh, I am back. 
and I'll be back full time then for the US Open as well. But nice to have you in. And um, we've got a prediction as well for Serundolo in three. It's uh, two Serundolo in three sets predictions here. And why don't you all uh, get your predictions in and let me know how you think this one's going to go. Yeah, I think uh, I think I may edge Serundolo in this one, although it is hard to look past that match that Karenja Busta played against Schwarzman. I didn't actually get to see that match, so I'm I, I from what I've heard, it was Karenja Busta hit like playing really really well, and it wasn't Schwarzman playing badly, but uh, not entirely sure. But at least Serundolo has got a game here, which is uh, he avoids the bagel that Schwarzman got. Oh, we got, you get 152 likes yesterday. That's pretty impressive for, uh, yeah, an ATP 250. David's been doing really well this week with the tournaments, hasn't he? But uh, yes, everybody, if you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button because I will really, really appreciate it. Oh, we've got PCB in two here. Well, we have a challenge, so our first challenge of the match here. It's always interesting to see the, the Hawkeye system on clay. And, oh, that was out by the smallest of margins. So it is 40 love here for Karenja Busta. Oh, second serve here. You can just hear a baby crying in the crowd here somewhere. I don't know if that's uh, going to put them off a little bit. Second serve, back and return from Serundolo. Down the line from Karenja Busta. Forehand is dug out by Ka Serundolo, excuse me. And Karenja Busta goes wide. It's 40-15. Uh, so it was a uh, PCB playing well. Yeah, he's uh, he's good on the clay as PCB. Although I think he's more of a hardcore player, which is, you know, unlike most of the Spanish players. But uh, yeah, Serundolo has been great. Serundolo took out top seed Casper Rude, didn't he? So yeah, I think, I think this is going to be a good one. So Karenja Busta with a inside-out forehand cross-court from Serundolo, cross-court from Karenja Busta. Oh, what a good forehand cross-court there from Serundolo. It's short now for the drop shot from PCB and gets the error from Serundolo. So Karenja Busta has got the first game on his on the board. It is one game apiece. Don't mess with me because you know I'm going to crush you. Another point for Karenja Busta. Karenja Busta. <laughs> I haven't seen that button before. Not bad. Yeah, I, uh, like I said, I, I didn't see that match, but I saw the scoreline. It was, uh, yeah, a breadstick and a bagel. I think Serundolo is going to put up a better fight. Like, and yeah, as you said, taking out Casper Rude, top seed. Three sets, I think that was as well, wasn't it? Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, Serundolo, he's a very exciting player to watch. I have been keeping an eye on him uh, since I, I saw him make, I think he sort of made his announcement at the beginning of this year, and I've been... Uh, Keeping an eye on him throughout the year. So Serundolo oh, just goes wide on the backhand cross court there. So it is love 15. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button. We have got our first semi-final here of the day in Bastard. It is a second semi-final after this one versus Andre Rublev and Sebastian Baez. That should be a good one as well. Love 15 here for Serundolo. Good first serve block return from boost that is long. 15 all. Yeah, so there is another Serundolo brother. I believe Francisco is the younger brother, although I, don't quote me on that. But uh, there's Juan Manuel Serundolo. Um, I'm going to pull his profile up actually on the ATP website because I'm, I'm, I could have sworn one of the Serundolo brothers had won a title. But. It's not Francisco because I can see on here that sort of Francisco hasn't got any titles to his name. So I'm going to look up Juan Manuel, which is his brother. Ah, it was Juan Manuel. So Juan Manuel won the title this year. So I remember they, they both sort of made finals very close together, did the brothers, uh, two separate finals. Uh, Juan Manuel won his and he won, that was at uh, Cordoba. Well, that was actually last year. Wow, gosh, that was that long ago, geez, time is flying. So Juan Manuel is ranked 114. He's aged 20. So maybe Juan Manuel is 
Manuel is the younger brother. Serundolo is 23. Okay, ranked 39. So yes, Serundolo, Francisco Serundolo is the older brother, but it is Juan Manuel, the younger one, who has got uh, an ATP title. 30 all here on the serve of Francisco Serundolo. Yeah, he might have, Lexi. I, I just remembered that uh, they both sort of announced themselves because they, they were doing quite well in, in separate tournaments at the same time. Um, I'm not sure. I think that maybe they both had made the final of uh, two separate clay court um, tournaments. Francisco didn't win his, but Juan Manuel did. But of, obviously, Juan Manuel is still ranked outside the top 100, whereas Francisco is uh, he's working his way up the rankings very well. Although he does have a break point here. Carino Busta. Yeah, JC, so uh, Juan Manuel is 114 in the world. Serundolo at 39. So he, he's made great strides this year um, as Francisco. Second serve here on the break point for Serundolo. Backhand return from Carreño Busta. Forehand from Serundolo. Carreño down the middle of the court. Oh, it just lands in. It's a short forehand there from Serundolo. Oh, what's a great inside out forehand from Francisco Serundolo to save the break point. We are at juice. Yeah, indeed, it is. Uh, yeah, the younger one with the title. So if Francisco wins, this would be his first ATP tour title. It would indeed. Uh, have a look and see what uh, that final was. So singles final, it was, ah, it was Buenos Aires. Yeah, so last year there was uh, Cordoba and Buenos Aires, the two ATP uh, 250 tournaments on the clay. Juan Manuel got to the final in uh, Cordoba and won that. And uh, pretty much the same time, Francisco got to the Buenos Aires final, but did not win that title. So he is looking for a first. So we're out juice. One break point has been saved, but that backhand goes into the net from Serundolo. So it's another break point here for Pablo Carreño Busta and the fist pump there. Yeah, I think so as well. From early days as well, it's uh, some good rallies in this match so far. And two break points for Carreño Busta. He can capitalize on the second one, though, the Spaniard. First serve from Serundolo. Oh, chip return from uh, Carreño Busta. Now the backhand cross court. Forehand from Serundolo. PCB goes back cross court. Oh, it's just land landed in there from Serundolo. Oh, and that one again. The angle from Serundolo. Very good. Looped up by Carreño Busta. Oh, and Serundolo comes into the net to put the backhand away. Mm, it's another break point saved. We are back at juice. It's turning out to be quite a good match so far. Some good rallies here. He just got uh, Pablo Carreño Busta on the wrong foot there, going the wrong way. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button. Do it as a favor for me, would you please? Every like really does help us. It's good to be back. It feels like I've been away for so long, but it's been less than a week, really, since Wimbledon. Well, yeah, about a week. Good to be back with this one. Serundolo saved two break points at Juice now with a second serve. Took out top seed Casper Rude on the way here. I think that was his opening round as well, wasn't it? Uh, taking out Casper Rude. Oh, big forehand down the line from Serundolo. It's lobbed up by Carreño Busta, but oh, was that? It was just in there from uh, Serundolo. He now puts the overhead away. That was close there, but he does get the advantage of Serundolo. That's a good play there, finding the lines. And Carreño Busta on the defense. <laughs> managed to get two balls back and play, did Carreño Busta, but eventually the third one got put away by Serundolo. And he now has a game point after saving a couple of break points. I'm liking this kit from Serundolo as well. It's a, like a black and a greenish kind of color. It's pretty cool. First serve into the net from Serundolo. Can he close this one out? Be a good hold to serve if he does. Second serve, 400 turn from Carreño Boost. That is a beauty, though. He took that one on the rise, did Pablo. And it is back at juice. What a return. Cross-court winner. Clean winner off the return there for Pablo Carreño Boost. That. 
think he's quite an underrated player, as Carreño will start early. I mean, he's got some pretty good results. He's a multiple Grand Slam semi-finalist. But he just doesn't quite get uh, talked about very much. I sent a net there from Carreño Busta, so it is an advantage again for Sarundolo to try and close this uh, pretty lengthy second service game out. Advantage Sarundolo, good serve. Back and return is well wide from Carreño Busta, so Sarundolo, after saving multiple break points, he does indeed hold serve. It is two games to one. Francisco Yeah, dude, that was a very lengthy game, that third one, but uh, Sarindula does come through it after taking, well, saving a couple of break points. And yeah, you're very right, Nicole. Uh, Juan Manuel won Cordoba, Francisco at the same time, got to the final in Buenos Aires, but didn't win it. So this would be a first ATP Tour title for him if he can win this one. He has to get through PCB, though, to reach the final. Awaiting him would be Andre Rublev or Sebastian Baez, who's had a really good week as well as Baez. Got that really good win over Dominic Team. Dominic Team has been playing really well again. It's so good to see Team playing well, looking more like himself really this week. He hadn't won a match since in over a year. I think it was May last year that his first uh, his last win came. Got his first win here in his first round against uh, I think it was Rosavori, and uh, yeah, eventually getting a couple more wins. Coming unstuck by. Uh, Sebastian Baez in the end, but uh, it's good to see a uh, team playing well again. I've missed Dominic's team on the tour. Ha, <laughs> yeah, finally, he does come through it, does Serundolo. So he is in the lead, 2-1. Got some watching from Vietnam. Hello to you. Thank you for joining me uh, all the way from Vietnam. Hello to everybody who is uh, joining me. If you are watching, please don't forget to hit the like button. Oh, Lexi asks, who do I think will be win between Rublev and Baez? It's, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of both of these players, actually. Um, I, I love Andre Rublev, but it's been really exciting to watch Baez come through this year. I, I think Baez might do it. I think he's been playing really, really well this week. Um, although, you know, Rublev is very, very good at the 500 and 250 level, but I think it's going to be a good close match. I may, may just edge Baez, you know. I, I feel terrible saying that because I, I, I feel like I'm betraying Rublev, but <laughs> I think... I think I might give the edge to Baez, just based on how he's been playing. A little shake of the head there from Serundolo. As uh, Carreño Busta gets the first point in this game, 15 love. Good serve, back and return. Cross got forehand from PCB. Now the backhand cross from Serundolo down the line from uh, Carreño Busta, and it's long there from Serundolo, 30 love. Yeah, I'm with you there, Lexi. I'm, I am a big fan of Andre Rublev. Um, I would, I'd like to see Rublev come through it, but again, I'd be happy. I'd be happy for for Byers as well. I think, yeah, it's it's nice to see Rublev back. Obviously, not being able to play at Wimbledon, I I, I missed watching him play. It's good to have him back. Second serve here oh, was just in there from PCB, and the return is long. I think Serundelo wants a second look at this one. He's walking towards the net. But no, I think he's conceded the point here. That was long. It's 40 love here for Karenja Busa. So after a pretty lengthy service game for Serundolo, Karenja Busa's flying through this one. 40 love. Oh, it's an ace down the tee. And he does get a game to love. That'll be very nice indeed there for Karenja Busa after the previous service game. To all. <laughs> Hello to you as well. Thanks for joining me. Hope you're doing very well. I'm glad you are. Uh, I'm glad you're enjoying the commentary. It's nice to be back. Got Serundolo now here serving at two games apiece. Good serve back and return. Serundolo with the forehand on the middle. Karenja Busta. Oh, clips the net there. But it uh, lands pretty nicely there for Serundolo. 
cross court backhand now from Carreño boost a drop shot from Serundolo. Can Carreño get there? Oh, just about, but it's into the net. It's 15 love. Nice drop shot there from Serundolo. Yeah, Lexi, I, I didn't actually get to see that match. I was keeping an eye on the scores and uh, it felt like, you know, I just checked the scores and the match was starting and about two minutes later, the match was over. Yeah, it was 11-1, I think he lost, wasn't it? So, yeah, it's it's very surprising. Obviously, Schwartzman, an excellent uh, player on, on the clay. Very, very surprising. I know Carreño Bost is a great player himself, but 11-1, uh, very surprising. Like I said, I didn't get to see the match, so I'm not entirely sure whether he was playing very badly or not. Um, but, yeah, it's maybe worrying times there for Schwartzman. We have a double fault here, the first of the match from Serundolo, so it is 15 love. I just see seeing Rublev looks stronger. Yeah, I haven't again, I haven't I haven't really been able to see much of these matches. I've had them on in the background while I've been uh, doing my writing, but good to see Rublev looking good. So it's, uh, it's a bit of a worry, you know, when these players are not allowed to play Wimbledon, whether you know they'd be able to just sort of put that behind them and come back looking strong. So I'm I'm glad to hear that uh, Rublev is playing well. Obviously, you know, based on the scores, he's playing well. He's into the semi-finals here. I think it is going to be a, a very very good match that one. I will be keeping an eye on that. It's 15:30 here on the serve of Serundolo. So again, Karenia Busta's pretty much rolling through his service games. Serundolo's working a lot harder. So 15.30 here for Serundolo. Good first serve, back and return here. Oh, it's a good one too from Francisco Serundolo. Big forehand on the plus one. 30 all. <laughs> Watching it and shaking your head. Oh, was it, was, was it, was he playing badly, Diego, in that one? I noticed that uh, oh, there was one match. I remember one of the uh, the tennis journalists saying it was a terrible quality match. I think it was one of Serundolo's matches. I think it was Serundolo Karatsev was saying that it was really bad. Um, yeah, I'm not entirely sure about what the quality of the tennis has been like this week. But uh, yeah, like you say, Rublev and uh, Baez looking very, very strong as well as Karenia Busta. Diego Stefanos match. Ah, uh, yes, the, uh, the Monte Carlo Diego Stefanos match, Lexi. That was that was a really good match, actually. That was um Schwarzman was pretty comfortably up in that decider, I think, there. And uh Stefanos somehow managed to, to come back. Yeah, I remember that match. That was very, very good. Well, Sarundolo hangs on. It is three games to two here. So yeah, he is working harder on serve. You see here with some stats. Karenia Booster's stats. 100% points won on the first serve, 80% won on the second serve. That's very, very good from PCB. But it is a good hold of serve there for Francisco Serundolo. So, of course, we haven't just got uh, Bastard uh, going on. We have the, the Newport tournament as well. We've got the semifinals of that later. The first one will be uh, Maxime Cressy versus John Isner. And the second one will be Jason Kubler versus Alexander Bublik. Bublik who took out Murray yesterday. Murray had a, having a pretty good run, actually, looking good there. And also the uh, the two women's tournaments that we've got going on. So the uh, the Budapest tournament, they, those semifinals will be played today. So you have uh, Krunic versus Putin Seva and then Pera versus Bondar. We've also got the uh, Lausanne tournament. The first semifinal that was already played this morning, we uh, saw Olga Danilovic defeat Anastasia Potapova in the uh, in straight sets in that first semi-final and we have uh, Caroline Garcia and Petra Martic on court now in that second semi-final that should be a good one as well I was a uh, debating whether that one or this one to cover but I, I figured since uh, we've been covering the Bastard tournament throughout the week and we'd be covering the other semi-final it'd be better to to cover this one it was a, a hard decision but uh yeah I went with this one in the end but I'm keeping an eye on that match as well Petra Martic, Martic is up and break in the first set over there, she's serving at three games to two. But we have here now Carreño Busta, all on serve so far. He's had a couple of break points to look at, but hasn't been able to convert them. So he's down at three, two. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button. Really appreciate it. And subscribe as well if you haven't already. Good serve there from Carreño Busta. Back and return from Serundolo. Oh, finding the line there is PCB. 
playing with the angles. He now comes in with the volley. Oh, that's an excellent point from Carreño Booster. Pulling the ball from side to side, finding the lines and eventually putting it away with a volley at the net. That's a good point from Pablo. 15 love here. Great movement. So Carreño Booster on the first serve here at 15 love. Oh, it's an excellent serve. Serundolo gets the return in, though. Now the forehand from Carreño Busta. Backhand cross cut from Serundolo. Backhand cross cut from Pablo. Oh, now it's down the line from Carreño Busta. What a shot on the backhand down the line there from PCB. It's 30 love. This is a good service game for Pablo Carreño Busta. Just pulling Serundolo around the court. very strong is Pablo 30 love here can serve 400 return oh it's a, a slight miss hit there from Carreño Busta 30 15 doesn't too, look too worried about that though there's Pablo tournaments uh, next week we've got Hamburg an ATP two fi uh, 500 and a WTA 250. Obviously, uh, in the run up to the American swing on the hard courts. So that's a good serve here from Carreño Busta. The return goes into the net from Serundolo. It's 40 15. <laughs> yeah, come on, Serundolo, break him. Yeah, it's, well, Carreño Busta is looking hard, hard to break him on serve for, at the minute. He's, uh, he's serving very well. 40 15 here. Yeah, it's a good serve back. Oh, sorry, no, it wasn't a good serve. It was called out. Nicole saying, I think a Rublev may be in better form. The team match may have burned Byers out. Yeah, that was a tough one uh, between the team and Byers. Three set match, tie break in there as well. Really pushed. I agree. Yeah, it depends whether he can bounce back from that or not. If he can find that level again, uh, yeah, I would definitely give Byers a chance, but uh, there is a very good chance he is burned out by that match. That is true. Rublev, of course, is. No stranger to to the tour. He's uh he's used to playing tournaments back to back and winning them as well. He's he was on a, a tear of uh, ATP 500 tournaments last year as Rublev, so uh, fitness won't be an issue for him. Karen Yabusta, another easy service hold there. Three games apiece. Sarundalo still hasn't had any break points on the serve of Karen Yabusta. The serve here, forehand return it is long from Carreño Busta. 15 love, please don't forget to hit the like button if you are watching along. Let's try to get, I don't know, let's see, let's try to get the 50 first. Go on, let's do it. Good serve here. Oh, no. Again, there's a, a late call on that one. I thought it was a, a nice deep serve into the box, but I think it just missed the line there. Second serve. And a let here as well. Oh, Eric is a PCB fan. Yeah, he's, uh, he's doing well on service PCB, and he's had a few uh, break points. Second serve here for Serundolo. Back and return from Pablo. Backhand from Serundolo. Oh, but Pablo goes wide there on the looped forehand, and it is 30 love. Leslie asking, is Rublev playing any tournaments next week? Uh, I can have a look at the uh, the player list for Hamburg. Um, I, I think, is that the uh, the only ATP tournament next week? Um, let me check. Check the calendar for you now. So we have... Oh, this is starred as well, which is a 250. Hamburg is the 500. I would assume if Rublev is playing, he'd be playing Hamburg. So I'll have a look and see if they've got the player list here. He is indeed, Andre Rublev is the second seed, I believe, in Hamburg. I'm not sure if they've... Oh, I don't know if they've announced the seedings, but uh, they've got a Carlos Alcaraz, Andre Rublev, Diego Schwartzman, Pablo Carreño Booster is, uh, is on the list for Hamburg as well. But yeah, it looks like Andre Rublev will be playing the uh, ATP 500 in Hamburg next week. Well, this would be a nice, easy service holder for 
Sarundalo, if he can get it, and he does get the game to love here, this Sarundalo. That is a much needed easy service hold after fighting very hard on his previous two. He does indeed get a game to love, does Francisco Sarundalo. <laughs> And that'll uh, give him a bit of confidence going forward. I think it's four games to three, Sarundolo in the lead. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Sarundolo. Oh, oh, oh. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Sarundolo. Yeah, indeed, a nice GTL game to love there for Sarundolo. Yeah, I would not be surprised if this goes to a tiebreak, Lexi. It's uh, it's very close to so far. Nothing really to separate them. I mean, of course, Karenja Booster with a few break points. But Sarundolo's he's holding steady on his serve. Would not be surprised if this goes to a tiebreak. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button. I could use the likes today. Although I know uh, my last match I did was a Nadal Fritz. Don't think I'll get close to that. We uh, we ran out of buttons for the likes on that one, but we can, uh, we can try and get to 50, 100 maybe. Let's see. Of course, I think a lot of people are taking a bit of a break from the tennis post Wimbledon. It's it's like I said, it's strange watching a tennis back on clay again, especially as the next slam will be a hard court. Oh, we have a. Uh, a bet here for Francisco to win the whole tournament. He's got a good chance. Oh, no way. No worries, JC. I'll, uh, I'll see you back in a little bit. Karenja Booster serving at 3-4. Still no breaks of serve. It's a good serve. Looped 400 back and return is short. Karenja Booster is there to put the ball away, but he makes the unforced error here as he goes wide with the backhand. It's love 15. And maybe the first time Sarundalo's had a love 15 on the serve of Karenja Busta. Good serve again. The forehand return. Now the forehand cross court from Karenja Busta. Down the line from uh, Sarundalo. Cross court from Karenja Busta. Oh, it's just wide there from Karenja Busta. And it is love 30. So it's a first, first half chance here for Sarundalo on the serve of Karenja Busta. So if he breaks here, he'll be serving for the first set. Slightly against the run of play here. Karenja Boost has been sailing through his service games, but here we have Love 30. Sarundalo may be eyeing the break here. Good serve. 400 turn. Oh, it's a good return. Oh, but Karenja Boost gets it just over the net, but Sarundalo. Has Karenja Busta again going the wrong way? And it is this time three break points for Fran Francisco Serundolo. It was a good return there. Three break points here. Can he convert one of them and serve for this opening set, Francisco? Oh, it's an ace from Karenja Busta to save the first break point. It's his second ace of the match, 15-40. Still two break points here for Serundolo. Can he save another one? Karenja Busta. Oh, went for the ace down the tee, but it was just wide. Second serve here on the break point. Forehand return. Oh, it's long. He'll be frustrated with that one, Serundolo. Second break point saved here. 30-40. Oh, this would be a very good hold from Karenja Booster from Love 40 down. Still a break point for Serundolo. Can he capitalize? Go on, hit the like button if you are watching along. It would really help me out. Oh, it's a good serve from Karenja Booster. The looped return is in from Serundolo. Another forehand from Karenja. On the run, the backhand from Serundolo, the drop. Oh, no, it's lobbed up by Serundolo here. Can PCB put the volley away? Yes, he can indeed. <laughs> it's three break points saved for Carreño Busta. We are a juice from Love 40. That is an excellent dig out of a pretty big hole. Oh, 
Managing to put the overhead volley away there, the Karanya booster. Finally close out that point. Crisis averted for now. 40, 40 all. Deuce. <laughs> Good serve. Back and return. Forehand from Karenio Busta. Now the backhand down the middle of the court from Serundolo. Cross court from Karenio Busta. Backhand cross court from Serundolo. Through the middle of the court here. Now the cross court forehand. Down the line. Forehand from PCB. Through the middle of the court. Oh, it's into the net from Karenio Busta here. And it is a fourth break point for Francisco Serundolo. It is advantage. Serundolo here. Crowd trying to get involved here. They've been a bit subdued throughout this match so far. But this could be a key turning point in this first set if Serundolo can capitalize on this fourth break point. Karenio Busta at advantage. Well, down the advantage. What oh, a good serve. Forehand loop return is in on the forehand from Karenio Busta. Backhand from Serundolo. Cross cut from PCB. Down the middle of the court, just lands into the baseline, does a Serundolo. A big, big forehand cross court from Francisco Serundolo. And he does get the break point, does Francisco. He gets the break of serve, excuse me, and he is up five games to three. And it is Francisco Serundolo who will be serving for this opening set at 5-3. That's a, a quite a turnaround here. Thought maybe Karenia Busta would be the first to jump on the on the breaks of serve since he'd had the early looks. But it is Serundolo with the advantage here. It's hard to know who the crowd is supporting, actually. They don't they don't really seem to be for one particular player or the other, but uh, you know, they've just sort of been trying to get involved on the break points. I'll keep an eye out for the crowd support, though, and uh, try to try to gauge maybe if they are swaying towards one or the other. But we've got Serundolo serving for the opening set here. The so ball clips the net from Karenio Busta, but it's uh, it sits up there for Serundolo. Great length there. cross cut forehand from Serundolo. Oh, and he's at the net for the volley of Serundolo. It's 15 love and a fist pump as well from Francisco. Crowd loved that one. That's a good. Is we get the replay there from uh, Serundolo. Good volley at the net. Yeah, exactly. Like you would have thought. Uh, yeah, I really thought Karenio Busta would have been the first to break here, given the way his surface games were going and Serundolo working a lot harder. But that was a, a good break from Serundolo, and he's 15 love. He had a good serve for one return on the back and on the middle of the court from Serundolo. Cross court backhand. Now the backhand on the line from PCB is dug out by Serundolo. Oh, it's a good cross court though. Forehand from uh, pa Pablo Carreño Busta. It's 15 all. I believe you can uh, you can watch the channel on uh, the the match on Tennis Channel. Uh, you can also watch it on all your you know usual. I'm, I'm watching it on Sky, but I believe Tennis Channel is also streaming it. 15 all here. Serundolo trying to serve this opening set. It's a good serve. Back and return. Forehand from Serundolo. Forehand cross cut from PCB. He keeps going back to that forehand wing to Serundolo and gets the error from PCB. It's into the net. It's 30 15. Two points in this opening set now. Go on. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. We have 40,000 subscribers during Wimbledon, which is a, which is a huge target for us. We've got 50,000 as our new target. 30-15 here for Serundolo. Two points from the set. Second serve here as that one goes wide. Second serve, Serundolo. Backhand return, cross court from PCB. Forehand from Serundolo. Backhand cross court again from PCB. Which is cross court to cross court here. Oh, it's into the net from Serundolo. 30 all. <laughs> and a... A look down the court there from Serundolo. Not happy with that unforced error. The uh, first semi final over in uh, Budapest is just underway between Krunic and Putin Seva. Krunic up the early break over there. Serundolo, 30 all. It's a good serve. 400 turn cross court. Oh, the drop shot from Serundolo was a very, very good one. And the crowd loved that one. That's a lovely forehand drop shot. And it is a set point here for Francisco Serundolo. 
Silky smooth on that one. Just cut the ball. The crowd here. Possibly in favour of Sirungalo. Not sure, but he has got a set point. That's a great serve. That's an excellent serve to secure the opening set from Francisco Serundolo. He takes it six games to three. And Serundolo, well, thought it might have been Carreño who took that one, but it is Serundolo with the advantage, and he's just now a set away from a place in another ATP final. Serundolo, 6 3. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Francisco. So it's a very good uh, set to take there from Francisco Serundolo. He faced a couple of break points on his own serve, but he saved them all and eventually got the break on Carreño Busta's serve. So he is up six games to three. I can tell you uh, as well over in uh, Lausanne, Petra Martic is just also a game away from the opening set. She leads Caroline Garcia 5-4. We'll be serving for that. Of course, the next one that we have here is Baez versus Rublev. We'll have a look at the, uh, the the draws for both men here. So you had Serundolo see, beating uh, Pedro Sosa from Portugal in the first round. Then uh, took out top seed Kasper Ruud. Then beat Aslan Karatsev in his previous rounds to reach this match between Pablo Carreño Busta. PCB, on the other hand, he, uh, oh yeah, he got that a uh, good win over Stan Morinka in the opening round, then took out uh, Ramos Vignolas, and finally that very, very uh, one-sided match against Diego Schwartzman to reach the semifinals here. Good morning to you, Peaches. Hope you're doing well. Thanks for joining me on the stream. It is it's good to be back, finally, uh, talking about tennis. I've missed it. It's only been a week, but I have missed it. If you don't all know me, my name is Megan, and I am one of your commentators here. I've been doing it for a, about a, a two months or so now. And I will be able to be doing it uh, pretty much full-time from the end of August, September as well. So Francisco Serundolo here with the opening set, six games to three. We'll have Pablo Carreño Busta serving to get us underway in this second set. Good serve, 400 turn is into the net from Serundolo, 15 love. If you are watching along, please don't forget to hit the like button. Honestly, I know I'll keep banging on about it. We always keep banging on about it, but it really does help people to find the channel. Helps us to grow it. Good serve again, 400 turn. Oh, clips to the top of the net. Now, the oh, it's long there from Carreño Busta. May have caught him off guard slightly, that net caught from Serundolo, 15 all. Yeah, indeed. A uh, good point here. Pablo Carreño Busta, the, the champion in Hamburg last year, uh, the ATP 500. He will be playing it uh, again next week. So he'll be defending a lot of points, 500 points, like you said, going in as the defending champion. Oh, and uh, a slight uh, uncharacteristic display of frustration here from Carreño Busta. At 15.30, as he goes wide, not happy with himself, maybe not happy with himself for dropping that opening set after having chances. Hello, Capo. Good to have you with us again. It's nice to be back and seeing you all again. Yeah, vamos indeed. So uh, I, I, I like both of these players. Enjoy watching them both. And it goes long here from Serundolo, 30 all. Needs to just settle here, Karenia Booster, after dropping that set. Get himself a good hold on the board. A second serve here. Second serve, backhand return from Serundolo. Another backhand cross court from PCB. Down the middle of the court goes Serundolo. Now cross court, forehand is looped up by Garena Busta. That's a short ball here from Serundolo. Now with the cross court, slice backhand from Serundolo. PCB with the forehand. 
forehand from Serundolo, crosscut from Carreño Busta, a slice backhand from Serundolo, crosscut backhand from Carreño Busta. Oh, it's just landed in there from Serundolo as we go on. It's a crosscut rally. Serundolo takes it down the line. He's an excellent backhand down the line from Serundolo. That just clipped the, net, the, the sideline there. And it is a break point in the opening game of the second set for, for Serundolo. A little apology there from uh, Serundolo. Not entirely sure. Maybe it was slight miss it or maybe clip the net there. But it is a break point here for Serundolo to begin this second set. You feel Carreño Busta. I don't know if he goes down the early break here again. Hello, Tennis Club. Thank you for joining me. Yeah, it's uh, nice to be back on the stream. Nice to see you all again. It's a pretty good match so far. It was Carreño Busta who uh, who had the early looks in the opening set. He had some break points, couldn't convert them, and he was flying through his own service games until eventually, towards the end of the set, Serundolo managed to break and uh, served it out. And he has a break point here. Forehand from Pablo. Backhand down the line from uh, Serundolo. It's dug out by Carreño Busta. But it's a good forehand crosscut from Francisco Serundolo. And Serundolo does indeed break to open the second set up. It is a one love Serundolo. And uh, he seems to be running away with this one now. Quite like that little song. I'm having a, a bit of a dance to it there <laughs> while you guys can't see me. I was going to sing Boost Thou Will Come Back. But yeah, um, not the same as yesterday. PCB has been looking very good this tournament. Uh, it's uh, slightly surprised by uh, this this score. And yeah, possibly just tanked the match. I don't know. Yeah, he's not looking like the Carreño Booster that I'm, that I'm used to. I haven't been able to watch many of the matches this week, but... He's usually such a fighter, this Kenny Bosa. You don't really see him give up. Uh, but at the moment, Serundolo seems to be coming through this pretty handily now. It goes along there from Kenny Busta, 15 love. Hello, I'm very well, thank you. I'm very happy to be back. I hope you are too. Hi, Sean. <laughs> Need to try and copy Serundolo's forehand. Yeah, he's got a lovely forehand, doesn't he, Francisco? Easy power, it looks like. Serundolo, 15 love. With the break, it's a good serve. Forehand return down the middle of the court from Serundolo. Forehand from Carreño Busta. Oh, and it's into the net there from PCB. It's 30 love. Yeah, he doesn't quite look. I don't know. I don't I don't want to say tanking. He's obviously he's well, he's, I don't think he's tanking, but he doesn't seem to have that fight in him, Carreño Busta, since since going down that break in that first set. 30 love here for Serundolo. It's a good serve. Back and return from PCB. Cross court forehand from Serundolo. Back and cross court PCB. Oh, good forehand. Inside out forehand there from Pablo Carreño Busta. It's 30 15. That's more like it. If you are watching along, please hit the like button. Do it as a favor to me. I would really appreciate it. I'm sure Ben and JG would as well. <laughs> oh. Prediction this one in easy set, Serundolo. And he does have the early break. All he needs to do now is hold serve. So let's see. Oh, it's a good, again, a good forehand from uh, Serundolo. That easy power. Oh, Carreño Busta tries to go for the forehand on the run, but it is wide and it's 40 15 here for Francisco Serundolo. Yeah, indeed. Uh, Played like a grand slam play yesterday to Pablo Carreño Busta with that, that win over Schwarzman, 11 1. And of course, he has reached a, a grand slam semi final uh, a couple of times before as Carreño Busta, so we know he can do it. But yeah, he just doesn't doesn't look like he's there. I feel like his, his will to fight has just sort of disappeared after losing that break of serve, 
well, losing it, losing his serve in that opening set. But credit to Sarundalo. Oh, as the backhand return goes long there from Carreño Busta, and it is a consolidation of that break. So Francisco Serundro leads two games to love. So he could run away with this one, Serundro. Carreño Busta needs to hang it in here. Find that fight. Find that form that he was against Diego Schwartzman. Because he crushed him. Carreño Busta serving. Love to. Down the break. Serve back and return. Forehand from Carreño Busta. Gets him out of position here. Another cross got back. And Sarundolo with that forehand lands on the baseline. Carreño Busta, they're finding the lines here. Oh. Oh, Carreño Busta has just. He's doubled over here, this Pablo. He's dropped his racket to the floor and was just doubled over there. I am not entirely sure if he's hampered by something because. That was slightly worrying. So a, a ball from Serundro hit the sideline. I think it may have checked off the line a little bit and uh, Carreño Busta couldn't get a racket on it, but he doubled over at the end of that point. So I'm not sure if there's an injury woe here or something happening uh, with him or if he was just frustrated. But something is not quite right with PCB here. Oh, that return of serve was just long from Serundro, 15 all. Yeah, indeed, he, he's not looking like himself at all. He's saying he's uh, not the same level that beat Diego at all. It's looking like it'll be Serundolo back into a final here. All oh, that return was just wide from Serundolo. 30-15, Serundolo wasn't happy about that one. He's having a, a little few words with his box, I think. Go on, hit that like button if you are watching along. Really help me out. Let on the surface. Yeah, Karenia Busta, his, his movement doesn't seem... He seems to be... I don't, I don't know. He looks a little lethargic now. I really don't know if maybe there's an issue bothering him here. Something physical. I think it was just the way he reacted after that point. I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I'll try to keep you updated if we do find out anything. Oh, it's long there on the uh, on the one-two from Karenia Busta. It's 30 all. Could be in danger of going down a double break here. Francisco Zerundolo is uh, pumped up at his end of the court. He wants to be in another final. His brother's won one title. He wants to win his first as well, does Francisco. Oh, good backhand cross court from Zerundolo, sliced out by Carreño Busta. And it goes long, and it is another break point here for Francisco Serundolo. And if he gets the double break here, you think the match is over and done with. The crowd trying to give some encouragement here to Carreño Busta. It is 30-40, a break point for the double break for Serundolo. Can he convert this one? That's a good first serve. The backhand return. Now the forehand cross got from PCB. Oh, Carreño Busta in frustration. Wax a ball into the crowd there. And it is the break of serve for Francisco Serundolo. It's the double break here. <laughs> Sorry, hit the consolidation button there. But it is a break of serve. And Francisco Serundolo, uh, well, it's, it's not. Looking like a good Pablo Carreño Busta here. Some, I think something might be bothering him. And uh, you, you really see him with displays of emotion like that, like whacking a ball out into the court. I'm not sure if he's going to get a warning for that uh, out into the crowd, excuse me, um, with that unforced error. But it is the double break for Sarundlo and yeah, yeah, yikes. <laughs> PCB needs to produce a miracle play here. I don't know if there's a way back for PCB in this match. Um yeah. It just doesn't look like he's got the fight in him. I think something might be ailing him. But it, yeah, it's the double break for Serundolo here. Uh, I'd feel kind of bad playing the Serundolo button after that one, but he has got the break, so I feel like he does deserve it. So double break, Serundolo. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Francisco. Oh, oh, oh. Serundolo. Over in 
in uh, Lausanne, by the way. Petra Mart has just taken the first set against Caroline Garcia. Garcia has been in pretty good form of late. But uh, 6 4 to Petra Matic in that first set, on serve in the second. So Francisco Sarundolo just about to step up to the line here to serve to consolidate the double break of serve. Not yet an hour played on the clock. Already is setting a double break up. It's looking good for Francisco Sarundolo here. Serving at three, love. It's a good serve back and return. Backhand from uh, Serundolo. Cross court PCB. Backhand cross court from Serundolo. Slice. Oh, it's a drop shot from PCB here. Serundolo is there. Puts it down the line. It's 15 love and a fist pump from Francisco Serundolo. Change of tactic there from PCB with the drop shot. Serundolo was up to it in plenty of time. It wasn't a bad drop shot. Hit the like button. Go on. Please do me a favor. Serundolo, 15 love. Oh, just misses the serve down the tee. He takes another little look down the court, but he's not going to challenge it. Second serve. Back and return from Carreño. Forehand from, piece, from Serundolo, excuse me. Now with the slice. Carreño booster with the cross. Carreño booster's at the net with the volley. Serundolo gets to it. Oh, down the line with the pass. Francisco Serundolo. And a fist pump again. It's 30 love. I thought that point was Carreño boosters. But somehow manages to come in and put it down the line. That's good play from uh, Serundolo. Good sliding into that drop shot. Dirty love here. Double break. Can he consolidate it? Four love lead. You feel like this will be over. Well, it kind of already does feel over, to be honest. The level from Karenia Busta, he just he's not that energy's not there from him. Oh, that return's just landed in from Carreño Busta. Now down the line on the backhand. Cross court from Serundolo. Goes long there from Carreño Busta. It is 40 love. Things are looking very, very bright here for Serundolo. It's looking like it's going to be another ATP final. A second ATP tour final. Yeah. I, I, hello again, MQR. Yeah, PCB. Yeah, ever since he, uh, he, he he dropped his serve in that opening set, he was doing really well. He was flying through his service games, eventually got broken. And since then, he's just not looked the same. He's, uh, I don't know, his energy just isn't there. And uh, after one point in particular, he was doubled over, put his racket on the floor and doubled over. And uh, he's, I think there may be something bothering him. And uh, PCB with a very uncharacteristic back and into the net there. And uh, it's a game to love here from... Uh, from Francisco Serundolo to consolidate the double break. <laughs> yeah, you, you did say tank. And uh, yeah, it's 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 strange because I've, ne I've never, personally, I've never seen Karen Yobusta had tank before. Um, he doesn't really strike me as that kind of player. Um, but it's, yeah, it's not looking good for him. And yeah, exactly. PCB was on fire yesterday against Schwarzman Love on one. But it's just, uh, it's not happening for him today. Serving at Love 4 is PCB. Forehand return. Backhand from PCB. Now the backhand cross court from Serundolo. Oh, it's an unforced error from Karen Yobusta as that forehand goes wild. It's Love 15 here. And, uh, uh, yeah, Eager's Bakery is open, I think. I think it's going to be a bagel. I mean, Karenja Busta was the one serving baked goods yesterday, but I think he's going to get served one of his own today, possibly. It's a forehand cross cut here. Oh, it's a drop shot from Karenja Busta. It works. <laughs> it works, that one. Crowd trying to give him some support for that. It's 15 love. Yeah, I... It's the same, Nicole. Like I, I, I really wouldn't expect this kind of thing from PCB. He just doesn't seem to be that kind of player. But that's a good serve from him, though. Thirty fifteen. To try and avoid the bagel. Yeah, maybe he just doesn't really know what else to do here. He's playing quite quickly as well between points as Pablo. Second serve. 
Backhand return cross court. Backhand from Pablo Carreño. Boost a slice backhand from Sarundolo. Oh, it's into the net from Pablo. 30 all. It could be a bagel here if Sarundolo breaks. That's it. The crowd really trying to get in now. They, they want to see a good match of tennis. But yeah, I agree with you. There's just something not not the same about PCB. Is he's just it, I think his head is not there. And is another unforced error with the forehand that goes wild. And it's a break point once again for Serundolo for a five love lead here. PCB's head is just not in this match. Not at all. Can he convert this one for a five love lead, Serundolo? Or Possibly a better question would be, can Karenia Busta give this one away? Second serve, backhand return. Forehand is long from Karenia Busta, and it's a break of serve for Serundolo once again. It's a third break of serve. It's a triple break, and Serundolo is going to serve for this match after the change of ends at five, love. Yeah, Sean's saying bagel on the ATP is poor. Yeah, it's uh, something you don't see as often as you do on the WTA tour. And uh, it is looking like it's going to be a bagel here. It really is. And that's very unexpected. You can say, Kenny Booster came out looking very good. He was flying through his service games. And uh, ever since got broken, he's just not been in this match. Sarundalo, fair play to him. He's, uh, he's kept this cool, playing his game, doing well. And he's going to serve for this one at 5 love. Following this one uh, will be Andre Rublev and Sebastian Baez. David's going to be uh, bringing that one for you. I can uh, also bring you some other scores. We've got a uh, Martic up a set uh, over in the semifinal in Lausanne against Caroline Garcia on serve in the uh, second set. We've also got uh, Krunic serving for the opening set against Putin Seva in the uh, semifinal over in uh, Budapest. So all the semifinals being played today. Across Bastard, Newport, Lausanne, and um, Budapest. Ah, oh, yeah, welcome back, uh, JC. Yeah, you uh, you missed a lot. <laughs> I know you stepped out for just a little bit, but uh, Karenja Busta has uh, has left the building. He is uh, his head is not in this at all. Three breaks of serve gone the way of Serundolo. Lots of unforced errors. Just doesn't seem to be fighting for it at all. This Karenja Busta. It's really surprising from him. But we've got Serundolo here serving for the match. Good serve. Forehand return. Oh, back to that forehand win goes Serundolo. Short ball from Karenia Busta. Good cross court there from Serundolo. Now with the forehand. Forehand down the line from Karenia. Slice backhand from uh, Serundolo. Short ball from Karenia Busta. Again with a slice. Oh, it's a good little slice from Karenia Busta. I love 15 here. Well, Karenia Busta. Uh, Bit of a better passage of play from him there. A couple of slices back and forth eventually with a drop shot. It's too good for Serundolo. Yeah, same here, Peaches. I, I thought this was going to be a really good match. And after the first couple of games, I, I, I thought it was going to be that way. Oh, it's just long there from Serundolo. So love 30 here. He may be feeling the pressure trying to serve this one out, possibly. Or maybe PCB is just playing like he has nothing to lose now. Let's see, love 30, Serundolo. Good serve. Forehand return down the middle. Forehand from uh, Serundolo. Back and cross court from Carreño Busta. Another, another forehand. Oh, is that in? Oh, I think it's just landed in from Serundolo. So her forehand just found the sideline there. I don't think Karen Yabusta or Serundolo was sure if that had landed in either, but uh, it's been called in. It's 15.30. Yeah, well, hopefully let, he's not choking. Uh, he's, he's clawed it back. Well, hello, Jean. Nice to see you. You've, uh, you've missed quite a bit. Uh, it was a good match for the first couple of games, and uh, all of a sudden it's, ooh, as I say that. A ball goes along there from uh, from Serundolo, and it's two break points here for Pablo Carreño Busta. 
I <laughs> just woke up, what's happening? Yeah, so uh, it was a pretty good match the first couple of games. PCB was going rolling through his service games pretty handily, actually. It was uh, Sarundalo who was working harder, saving break points on his serve. It looked like Karanja Busta was going to get the first break, but it ended up being Sarundalo who got the break and then served for the set. And ever since that, Karanja Busta has just been out of it. He's been absent. Uh, this is an uncharacteristic break point here for Karanja Busta because... Serundolo serving for it with the triple break. And he goes long and serving for the match. Serundolo is broken. That is unexpected. It's five games to one. So Carreño Busta avoids the bagel. And it is 5-1. He's on the board in the second set. No man's for me because you know I'm going to crush you. Another point for Carreño Busta. Yeah, I think uh, a couple of you predicted this would probably go to three sets, but it's not looking likely. Karenja Busta serving to stay in the match. Oh, it's great length there from Serundolo into the net from Karenja Busta. Love 15. Oh, we had a prediction from PC. All Argentine, Argentine final between Baez and Serundolo. That would be a good final. I'd definitely be uh, interested in watching that one. Baez obviously has to come through Andre Rublev first, and Sarundolo has to come through this one, although it is looking very likely. Yeah, indeed, Sarundolo took a set off Rafa at Wimbledon. Played pretty well there for a, for a point in, for a bit in that match with Sarundolo. And yeah, he is uh, improving that Miami semi-final run earlier this year. Of course, he, he did reach a, an ATP Tour final at 250 last year in Buenos Aires. Looking for a second final here. Trying to get his first title. Ah, oh, thanks for the nice words, JC. Yeah, we are. I'm, I'm really glad you're appreciating it. It's really nice to be back. I, I love doing this. So I'm glad you're enjoying it. And if anyone else is, please let me uh, a smooth segue here. <laughs> Hit the like button if you are enjoying it. Very, very much appreciated to all you who have liked and subscribed. Well, Karenja Busta here has got a bit of a second wind, I think. He's at 30-15. Serving to stay in it. Yeah, of course, Baez and, and Severeva at Roland Garros. That was a, uh, a good match. Baez probably should have won that one. That was a yeah, five set. Um, very, very good match there from, from Baez pushing Zverev. The world number two now is Zverev. So Baez, yeah, very, very good. It just depends if that match against team took it out of him. Oh, it's a great forehand there from uh, Francisco Serundolo. 30 all. How did he find that angle from that position in the court? Oh, Lexi predicting a Rublev Serundolo final. Yeah, we were saying that it was a bit of a crazy match yesterday with a PCB beating him love and one. It's not the same PCB today. Oh, Karenja Busta's into the net. And we have our first match point. It is 30-40, Serundolo with a match point here. <laughs> CB with the first serve into the net, second serve on match point. Yep, Baez did win Esther earlier this year, his first ATP title. Second serve, backhand return, forehand from PCB. Now the backhand from Serundolo, forehand cross court from PCB. Serundolo on the stretch, can't get to it. It is deuce here. So we saved another break. Well, he saved his first match point, his fourth break point that he saved, Karenja Busta. Trying to hang on here. Didn't look like he was particularly trying to hang on in his uh, previous games, but starting to pick it up again. Second serve. Back and return. Oh, just clips the net. PCB is there. Can he put the ball away? Oh, yes, he can. Serundolo tries for the cross-court pass, but PCB is there with the backhand volley. It's advantage, Carreño Busta. 
Oh, PC predicting that Baez will beat Andre Rublev. It's, I think it's going to be a good match, although I did say this one will probably be a good match. And uh, it's not really lived up to that particularly, but go on, hit the like button anyway. Hit it for me, if not for, for this. It's a solid performance here from Serundolo. Second serve, return down the middle of the court, another forehand. Oh, it's an excellent forehand from Francisco Serundolo. And it's uh, back at juice here. He wants to get this over and done with on the serve of Carreño Busta. He got broken serving for the match in his previous service game, did Serundolo. So he would love to break here. Maybe feeling the pressure a little bit was uh, the Argentine. Good serve. Back and return is into the net from Serundo. Advantage Carreño Busta. Again, another point to try and close this game out. Can he close this one out, Carreño Busta? Good serve. Back and return. Another back and cross court from PCB. Back and cross court from Serundolo. Going back and the back and here. Now with the forehand from Carreño Busta, forehand cross court from PC from Serundolo. Oh, it's a great shot down the line from Carreño Busta. It goes into the net from Serundolo, and he does hang on, Carreño Busta. So after facing match point and Serundolo serving for it, Carreño Busta has now avoided the big good. I thought it was going to be a bagel at one point, but it is five games to two. So Serundolo is going to get another chance to serve this one out, but Carreño Busta hang it in. Another point to Perennial Booster. Perennial Booster. <laughs> Do you mean uh, what, what's the, the bait good if you score two games? Yeah, I don't know actually. I might have to think about that one because you've got a bagel for zero, a breadstick for one. What would be two? Hmm. I'll have to think about that one. Sean, yeah, hopefully I'll be doing some Hamburg, uh, Hamburg next week. Uh, like I said, I'm uh, well this month. I'm in a mad scramble to finish my uh, PhD thesis, which is why I haven't really been doing many matches this week. But uh, yeah, I will be doing uh, hopefully some of Hamburg next week, and uh, yeah, US Open, the American Swing. I'll be definitely there. Yeah, indeed, this would be <laughs> this would be a huge comeback from PCB. From five love down. But Serundolo, let's see if he can serve this one out again. Maybe, you know, maybe it was just a few nerves. Oh, a swan. But then is a swan a big, isn't a big good? Well, yeah, you can get a swan. We can call it a swan. Let's go for a swan. I like that. I was, uh, I was also bringing you the uh, the score over in Lausanne for that semi-final. Uh, Matic took the first set. Garcia is now serving for the second set there. So that one looks like it's going to a third. But Serundolo stepping up to the line here to try and serve this one out again. Got broken serving for it the first time. Is Carreño Busta on the comeback? Yeah, it's a good point. I, I feel like that's all we've seen so many 5-2 uh, comebacks lately. The 5-2 curse. Let's see if Serundolo can break that. Oh, bold prediction that PCB will win here. He's got a big hole to dig himself out of. I'm just waiting for something here. I think there might be a disturbance in the crowd. Oh, but he's ready to go, Serundolo. Trying to serve this one out for the second time. Can he close this one out here? <laughs> right, now he's ready to go. Again, there was something in the crowd. First serve goes into the net. Second serve here. Second serve. 400 return. Oh, it's a wild return from Carreño Busta. 15 love. Three points away. A <laughs> right smile there from Carreño Busta. It's a good serve. Back and return. Oh, we have a shank. A shank from Francisco Serundolo. 15 all. <laughs> yeah, we'd be just trying to figure out what it would be if uh, if you get two games on the board. John came up with a, a swan, but then it's uh, well, what would you eat for two? I'm gonna have a think about that one. Oh, it's a great cross court there from Serundolo. Now with the backhand down the middle, PCB runs around for the forehand cross court backhand from Serundolo. 
Oh, it's just, oh, it's an overall. So I was going to say it's just landed in for Carreño Busta with the angle. But the umpire overruled it and called it out. Now, the, the line was just under the umpire's nose there. So you would think he would get this one right, the umpire. But Carreño Busta is going to challenge it. And it was indeed just out. So it is 30-15. Oh, wow, well, that's a that's an interesting matchup. I would love to see Alcaraz by us. That would be a really good one in Hamburg next week. Oh, return of serve is long from Carreño Busta, and it's match point number two here for Francisco Serundolo. <laughs> Match point Serundolo. Good serve. Backhand return. Forehand from Serundolo. Backhand Carreño Busta. Forehand from Serundolo. Oh, it's an excellent forehand. It's, can't do anything with that one. Can Carreño Busta. Francisco Serundolo manages to close it out on the second time of asking. Six games to two. And he does get the straight sets to win. Does Francisco Serundolo. 6-3, six, 6-2 six, against Pablo Carreño Busta. And he is into a second ATP Tour final is Francisco Serundolo. He couldn't get over the line in his last final over in Buenos Aires. Last year was the runner-up there. But he is going to go for another title here. And he, yeah, he did. He inverted the 5-2 curse. It is great for Serundolo. Something happened with Carreño Busta there. He did not look himself. Uh, but it was all credit all credit to Serundolo. He is through to a second ATP Tour final. Will it be Rublev or will it be Baez? David will be bringing you that semi-final uh, very shortly after this one. But it is Francisco Serundolo, the Argentine, through to a second ATP Tour final. So a, a very short one there, just over an hour. But thank you to everybody who, who has joined me. It is great to be back, like I said. Before we go, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And uh, I will definitely be seeing you for some more, hopefully for a, a final, one of the finals tomorrow. But uh, yeah, once again, thanks for joining me. And uh, enjoy the second semi-final in uh, Bastard, Rublev and Baez. But it is Francisco Serundolo with the win. Thanks for watching, guys.